shares in crypto exchange. Coinbase have gained 37% over the past week, alongside a recent surge in Bitcoin, and while analysts expect strong numbers when the firm reports its fourth quarter results on Thursday. According to aggregated data from MarketWatch and FactSet, analyst consensus is tipping a strong revenue boost for Coinbase in the fourth quarter, increasing by around 22% from the third and quarter to $825 million. Uh, some of this is uh, predicted to come from strong trading volumes, with analysts estimating a near doubling from $76 billion in Q3 to $142.7 billion in Q4. Estimates also pin Coinbase to report a fourth quarter earnings per share of $0.02, cents, a swing up from its previously reported loss of $0.01 cents per share in the third quarter. Um, COYN earning is tomorrow. Everyone, including myself, is trying to estimate it as close as possible. So we zoomed in and tracking um, volume, asset price, and etc. I think it's good time to to step back and look at how Coinbase has evolved from um, you know 2021 to 2023. Uh, uh, it becomes as the price of Bitcoin has increased. 16.3 percent uh, in the past seven days uh, according to data from coin market cap uh, on February 13th competitor trading platform Robinhood posted an overall revenue increase in the fourth quarter also due to a jump in crypto trading revenue uh, Robinhood's Q4 revenue is up 24 percent year-on-year uh, supported by $43 million in crypto trading revenue, which gained 10% year on year. Uh, however, not everyone is convinced that Coinbase will be able to continue gaining steam in 2024. Uh, and in a January 22nd note to investors, JP Morgan analysts pegged the share price of Coinbase to fall in 2024, pinning their expectations of Coinbase's poor performance on an underwhelming start to spot Bitcoin ETFs traded. However, while spot Bitcoin ETFs witnessed a bumpy first few weeks dragged down by the nearly $6 billion that poured out of Grayscale's newly converted GBTC fund between January 11 and February 2, net inflows have picked up significantly over the past few days. On February 13th, BlackRock's IBIT generated a whopping $493 million worth of inflows while all 10 ETFs witnessed a total of $631 million in net inflows on a day. Uh, Coinbase acts as the custodian for 8 out of 10 spot Bitcoin ETF providers, including BlackRock, iShares, and Valkyrie. Uh, another key sticking point uh, for, for Coinbase is, is its ongoing lawsuit with the United States Securities and Exchange Commission. Uh, and speaking to Crypto in the Magazine, crypto lawyer James Murphy also known as Meta Lawman on X, says he's confident the SEC will lose its case against Coinbase. And the Coinbase was sued by the SEC in June 2023, accusing a crypto exchange of disobeying its rules and selling unregistered securities. Uh, Coinbase shares are currently up 14% on the day with the prices of many publicly traded crypto companies being buoyed by a wider rally in the crypto sector, which was saw Bitcoin surge above $50,000 on February 13th.